The takeoff rides are some of the most intense rides on a fairground, pulling high G-forces from their high-speed rotation, and a steep lifting angle. The first Hus takeoff would be released in 1993 and would prove very popular in Germany. In total, around a dozen takeoffs were built by Hus. The takeoff is a machine that requires 72 feet by 72 feet of space, and has a capacity of 40 riders, with 10 riders in each gondola, 5 riders at each end facing each other. Birds of Ireland, would be the first to present a takeoff in the British Isles. They hired a machine from Germany, which proved so successful they bought their own at the end of 2004, in time for Funderland at the RDS in Dublin, the biggest fair in Ireland. Their machine was originally built in 1997 for von Berg of Germany, and would later be owned by Lehrman around 2002. The bird takeoff does many of the biggest events and fairs around Ireland, including Bird's own Euroshows and Funderlands in Belfast, Cork, and Dublin. The takeoff is also opened at the amusement park in Tremor for the summer. Years after the Irish machine, the second Hus takeoff in the British Isles would head to the UK. This one was acquired by English showman Walter Murphy in 2015. The machine was originally built for Ruth and Rash in 1993. Walter Murphy has opened this takeoff at many of the biggest fairs in England and Scotland including Nottingham Goose Fair, Hall Fair, Newcastle Hoppings, Edinburgh Meadows, Star City and Birmingham and Hyde Park Winter Wonderland to name a few. In 2020, Walter Murphy started working on modernizing the machine to make it easier to travel, with a folding floor and backflash, which was adorned with a superhero theme. With the Huss takeoff being a good seller for Huss, it was not long before other companies started making their own versions of the concept. Mel Park of Italy, now known as Technical Park, released the Shake Off or Move in Top, as it is sometimes known. The Shake Off was slightly smaller than the Huss Take Off, seating 32 riders in the same formation as the German built machine, but with 8 riders in each of the gondolas, with 4 riders facing each other. The Shake Off is 59 feet frontage by 69 feet deep, and travels on two trailers. Technical Park would sell around 9 units, with the first being built in 1995. In addition to these, they also produced a 64-seat version of the shake-off using the gondolas from the over-the-top. In 2010, Warren James was looking for a big machine to replace his giant wheel. He bought the Move-In Top in 2010. Originally built for Fosser of France in 1995, the Move-In Top was an eye-catching machine, with a colorful checker floor and a large backflash. The first round Warren James open Move-In Top was Bristol Thunderworld, after which, he moved on to the famous Boston Mayfair. Over the years, Warren James would open his machine at most of the major fairs in his local area, including the three big Nottingham fairs of Riverside Festival, Goose Fair and the Bonfire Fair regular as well as other big fairs in the region including Buxton Wells Dressing, Loughborough, Ilkeston, Lincoln and Abbey Park in Leicester. He would also travel all over Great Britain opening at Newcastle Hoppings in the north of England, and Kirkcaldy Lynx Market in Scotland. Over the years Warren James would change the name to take off, update the backflash artwork with a cityscape theme, and upgrade the lighting to LED. In 2019 he would sell the ride to the Mellers Group who now operate the ride in Saudi Arabia. A second technical park shake-off would arrive in the British Isles, with Albert Kessley buying Fabrice d'Atremont's shake-off from Belgium, originally built in 1996. This shake-off featured an unusually dark black and yellow color scheme, which perhaps would have suited the tastes of British and Irish teenage riders. The shake-off would mainly travel in Ireland, but would open in England once, at Hull Fair in October 2012. The shake-off would be exported to France at the end of the 2014 season. Along with the move-in top, Technical Park developed the over-the-top, a simpler version of the ride, offering the same extreme ride and capacity, but only one trailer. The over-the-top featured two gondolas holding 16 riders, with four riders each side, rather than two banks of four riders facing each other. The big backflash and run-ups were also done away with as well, and a front queuing system instead of platforms around the machine. Technical Park would sell a handful of these, including one to English showman Alan Crow in 1997. The over-the-top would travel extensively with Alan Crow, until he sold the ride to Sheldon Hart in 2011, who would continue to travel the ride, and in turn would sell the machine to James Stokes in 2016. James Stokes would continue to travel the over-the-top until its final English fair at Team Valley at the start of the 2020 season, after which it was exported to France at the end of February 2020. Between the three English showmen, they would open over-the-top all over including Northallerton and Boston May Fairs, Newcastle Hoppings, Nottingham Goose Fair, and Riverside Festival, Milton Keynes Bonfire Fair, Ilkeston Charter Fair, Hull Fair, Kirkcaldy Links Market, the Ferry Fair at South Queen's Ferry, and in London, 
It would open at the Millennium Fair on Potter's Fields next to Tower Bridge, and a few years later, at Hyde Park Winter Wonderland. Over the Top now travels with the Hurley family in France, who also own the ex Castle Shake Off, they have since renamed Over the Top to Shake Off, the same name as the Big Machine, as well as a similar style look. In 2022, they also acquired a second Over the Top from Nordisk Tivoli in Denmark, this will be the third Mel Park, Technical Park style Shake Off ride in the family. The Fun Fair Rides collection features hundreds of fairground ride videos from the past 20 years. You can subscribe for free, and get the latest updates as they are released. We thank you, for watching this Fun Fair Rides video.